Make a better friend of your horse by using a solo comb. This award-winning unique invention combines all the benefits of combing with an instant cutting action. Its ergonomically designed handle fits neatly into the hand allowing maximum leverage and minimum effort. The high quality stainless steel cutting blades are snugly hidden behind the teeth of the comb, eliminating any chance of cutting yourself or your horse. And it is particularly useful for persons with arthritis and other physical disorders and operates equally well for left-handed people. We recommend you start with a tangle-free mane or tail, using a conventional pulling comb to remove the tangles before using this precision instrument. Start at the withers, where the hair is naturally shorter and thinner. Decide what length you wish to cut off, then back comb and cut. Lift up the layers, back comb and cut. If you overload the comb with hair and just cut, you'll create a blunt look. So always back comb first and you will accomplish the feathered look normally fulfilled by pulling. When the desired length has been achieved, Clean up the ends as necessary. The solo comb works the same way on forelocks and whiskers too. Many thousands of pounds are spent every year looking after and caring for these splendid animals, ensuring that they get their right food, veterinary, farrier and dentistry care and giving them shelter with stables, horse boxes, rugs and comfortable tackle. But up until now we have submitted the horse and ourselves to unnecessary discomfort and pain by pulling their manes and tails, causing accidents to horses and owners too. The solo comb works well on all horses, coping equally with fine and coarse hair and really does produce a better finish than a pulling comb because it doesn't break or tear the hair, so there are no split ends. Most horses shy away from their tails being pulled, so when it comes to tails, back comb in and clip on both sides to produce the shape you want. Everyone develops their own style. So with a bit of practice you can quickly master the art of backcombing, producing sensational results. In busy yards like Haddon Stud, the comb has found its place, almost indispensable. So turn drudgery into pleasure and reduce the period it takes to cut manes and tails, making the job a pleasure for horse and owner too. Having done the trials on the solo comb for the last two years, I've found it extremely useful on all sorts of animals, ponies and horses, those with particularly thick manes or thin manes, and horses that are very difficult or apprehensive about having their manes or tails pulled, um, I've, on the whole it's been very very good and horses that have been a little anxious first time round um, the next time they've been very good and um, will stand without anybody even holding them I think we're excellent tools I had a mare at home it's impossible to pull her mane on my own I have no problems at all I think they sell themselves <laughs> Do the job in one stress free operation be in full control, no more upset horses, make a better friend of your horse, invest in a solo comb. <laughs>